The ones that are my real favorites, I won't sell. One of them is my self-portrait, which I have at home. Probably about five or six paintings that I have on my walls at home that I just won't sell. Because one of them, my wife asked me the other day, if somebody offered you 25000 would you sell it? I said, no. If they offered you 50000 mm, no. Then she says, what about a million? Maybe. <laughs> Well, you know, when I first started painting, I had, I had no idea that I would actually come to a point of when I would sell my artwork, show my artwork and sell my artwork, because I thought that when I got out of school, I would just be working as an a apprentice, you know, at an at a advertising company. But um, although I got so involved in the music, now I always kept painting. I mean, I, I, I've just, just would not stop, and I always loved it. it to me, it's a, another form of uh, another form of artistic creativity, and just what what I could do myself. Because um, I know that I'm not going to be able to 90 years old if I live that long uh, to be hitting those drums. You know, it's just not it's not realistic, and I know that that's not you know, in, in the future that I'm going to have to stop at some point. But I can paint until I'm a hundred and something. If I live that long, I know that I can continue to paint. So that's where I'm basing now the future of where, where my life is going to turn into it. And more of an artist than a musician 